SACC. Breaking news today. Breaking. Trump issues powerful demand to dodge. He's 100% right. Terrorist attacks have been executed throughout Europe since mass immigration became an acceptable governmental policy in the EU. Now, the first terrorist attack in New York since the Twin Towers fell has occurred, and President Trump has stated what he thinks would be the appropriate punishment for the perpetrator. At first, President Trump said he wanted Saflosipov to be interned at Guantanamo Bay for killing eight people and wounding eleven. However, President Trump has changed his mind, according to the Daily Caller. He decided that sending him to Guantanamo Bay would take too long. Instead, President Trump suggested that a more fitting penalty for Saipov would be the death penalty. His most recent two-part tweet starts, We'd love to send the NYC terrorist to Guantanamo but statistically that process takes much longer than going through the federal system. He continued. There is also something appropriate about keeping him in the home of the horrible crime he committed. Should move fast. Death penalty. It seems that the president was trying to make a simple point. He believes that the punishment should be quick and fitting, hence his decision. Saipov came to the United States via the diversity visa lottery program. This program, which is operated by the State Department, allows 50,000 immigrants to come to the U.S. every year. The program grants visas to people who want to come to the United States from countries that have historically low numbers of immigrants. This is how Saipov was able to come here from Uzbekistan in 2010. Due to the horrific attack and other stipulations such as people coming to the U.S. with no job skills or insufficient vetting President Trump is working to end the lottery system that is currently in place. Diversity lottery, sounds nice. It's not nice, he said. The president continued, it's not good. It's not good. It hasn't been good. We've been against it. He then went on to announce his plan to end the system. I am today starting the process of terminating the diversity lottery program. I am going to ask Congress to immediately initiate work to get rid of this program, President Trump stated. President Trump's wish to see Saipov moved through the justice system in an expedited manner is in line with the thinking of many other Americans. Saipov not only admitted to committing this horrible act, but he was gleeful about it. The fact that he was proud to have killed innocent Americans is enough motivation for Americans to seek swift justice, particularly the families of the victims. President Trump wants the Dodge to pursue the death penalty for the NYC terrorist. Do you think the Dodge should pursue the death penalty? President Trump has spoken strongly against illegal immigration, and immigration based on random chance, since before he was elected. Before this event occurred, he was pushing for a merit-based system where immigrants would be accepted into our country based on their skills and how beneficial they would be to American society. If a merit-based system is adopted, the country will experience a surge in immigration of highly skilled immigrants who will come into the country legally as a contributing member of society. Most importantly, they are more likely to accept and engage in American culture and values, reducing the risk of bringing harmful and violent extremist behaviors. There is nothing wrong with being proud of one's native land. It's part of being in the American melting pot. But one should be just as willing to accept this new way of life. After all, they immigrated to America for a reason.